Um, the second second part of this week's FAFO involves a VA employee assaulting, beating, and kicking a veteran in the head. Now, this bullshit took place last year, uh, June 22nd of 2022. Now, I did mention earlier, we had the ass whooping that happened, and in this case, we had the ass whooping that should have happened. Now, here, a 73-year-old Vietnam War veteran was uh, choked, slammed to the ground, stomped, and kicked in the head by a person who was allegedly a VA employee at the Fort McPherson, Georgia clinic, according to a security video which was released uh, last year. In the video, veteran Philip Webb is seen in a waiting room engaged in a heated discussion with an employee who points his finger in Webb's face. When Webb smacks the finger away, the employee grabs Webb's hands, wrestles him across the room, chokes him, slams him to the ground, presses his foot into Webb's neck, and then kicks him in the head. <sighs> the uh, assailant, Lawrence Galliard Jr., who happened to be a patient advocate at the clinic, has been identified by the VA as an employee, and he was arrested for the beating and charged with felony assault. A motherfucker advocate? Yeah. Wow. I, I can't even, you know, I don't even know where to begin. Especially the motherfucker of, that's looking out for you. Yeah, the levels of bullshit that, uh, you know, that that arouses. And um, I'm telling you, as I said, this is one of the ass whoopings that should have happened. Yeah. Do not under any circumstances accept physical abuse from any VA employee. Um, 